Hi, my name is Akio Yamanaka. Today is March 25th, 2010, and I'm going to show you how to install Drupal 6 onto your local host using the Acquia Drupal Stack Installer. This is the easy way of installing Drupal onto your computer, so I won't get into some of the more advanced settings. Now, understand that just because you install this onto your computer, it doesn't mean that you have updated your website on the internet. This is just on your computer, and you'll need an FTP program like FileZilla or Cyberduck to upload the Drupal site onto your online hosting. I'll be working on a Mac platform, but if you're a Windows user, there is an awesome tutorial by Rob from LearnByTheDrop.com entitled Acquia Drupal Stack Installer on YouTube. You should definitely check it out. So let's get started. First, you want to go to Acquia.com and click on the download link at the top. Then go to the Stack Installer for Mac OS X and click Download Now. This will download the Acquia Drupal Stack Installer onto your Downloads folder and place a disk image onto your desktop. So this should open up a window for the application. Double click on the installer and it will prompt you for a window that asks if it's okay for you to open the application. Click open. Next, type in your password. And this will open up the installer. So click Next to begin the installation process. This menu will give you a list of applications that it will install. So click Next. After you have read the license agreement, click on the radio button Yes and click Next. For the stack location, I would leave it Acquia Drupal. This will create a folder called Acquia. Acquia Drupal and install Acquia Drupal Stack Installer into this folder. For the site's location, I'll just leave it Acquia Drupal Site. Click Next. You can leave the port settings alone. Click Next. So in this setting, you're going to name your site. In my case, I'm going to name mine Acquia's Drupal Site. Um, I'll create a username, admin. Type in a password and confirm my password and type in my email. Make sure you remember this information because you'll need it later. Click Next. Once you review your information, then hit Next. Click Next again and you'll begin the installation process. This may take a few minutes. Once you're finished, you'll see this window congratulating you. Make sure this checkbox is checked and click Finish. It'll prompt you for your system password. Click OK and it should launch the control panel. It should automatically start the Acquia Drupal stack for you. If not, click on Start. Now, there's a bunch of options here, but we're going to do it the easy way and just go straight to my site. And you're in. So all you have to do now is enter your username. In my case, it was admin. And type in my password and log in. So now I've successfully logged into my first Acquia Drupal site. Now before I finish, I should point out again that you'll need to FTP your Drupal folder onto your online host. Now to access the files that you want to upload, you want to go to Macintosh HD, go to your user, in my case it's Akio, go to Sites, and you'll see an Acquia Drupal site folder. So open that, and in that folder you'll find two more folders, Acquia Drupal and PHP My Admin. So everything in the Acquia Drupal folder you're going to want to upload to your site. Okay, this ends the tutorial. I hope this helps.